That's true, sucks. but don't you think society works in the opposite way? Let's say that kid drops out of school and wants to go out into the working force. Everyone is mm -hmm. going to ask him or her first thing for a high school diploma, then if you have a college degree, then what kind of education have you completed? And sure. it all comes back to what your grades were, if you had put in a effort into it so in, sure. in, in one way students can opt out of it but that's what society requires i'd like to see that change in this world like i would like to see what what, what if you had someone who didn't go to college but read a hundred books and wrote some papers and was in the you know in the in the paper or they were in a journal or they you know whatever it is they were uh routinely published and then they, they want to become an English teacher. Or someone similarly, they worked as an accountant for 15 years and they want to become a math teacher. In New York, you'd have to go back to school and get a master's degree, right? Although you have this experience and you're passionate about what you do and you love what you do and you want to give back to the society, you have to now go through these motions to be able to do this thing. But that's not even, you know, that, that's not my... Biggest, that, that is a concern of mine, but that's not my biggest concern. They're getting used to being told what to learn and when to learn it and what, you know, is it going to be on the test. You start focusing on that too long, you stop, you stop focusing on yourself, right? And then you forget that this is the thing that you see the whole world through. Is that true? Is that what you, do you disagree with this? True. No, I do not disagree. <laughs>